Can you see me or not yet? Yeah, we do. Yes, teacher. Hello. We can see you, teacher. Okay, dears. Okay. Okay. So, we will start today with this lovely, funny activity, actually, in order to make you concentrate more in this lesson. And we are going to use also our fingers. You know this move? Can you do this move? Yes, that's perfect. Yes, Lydia. Lydia, I can't hear you. What? Uh, teacher, I can't see you. I'm not seeing you. I'm not... Try to change the screen. Try to change the screen. Okay. Uh, okay. So, please, all of you, try to do this move. When you make a sound with your thumb, index, and middle finger. Try to make this move. Yeah. Uh, okay, that, that's good. That's good. Okay, so what I want you to do now, we will start all of us together. Why? In order to make, in order to make the sound of the rain, okay? In order to make the sound of the rain. Do you love the sound of the rain? Yes, yes. yes. Yes, sister. the sound when it's raining. OK, that, that's good. So today we are going to make the raindrop sound when they get to the when they touch the floor. OK, when they touch the ground, they make sound. So today we are going to make it all of us together. OK, so what I want you to do, I want you to keep going with that move with me. And please just let's hear the sound that we all will make. OK, start. Start. So, so. You hear that? You hear that? Oh, I love it. Focus. Try to focus to hear the sound. Okay, make it harder now. Harder, faster. That's so cool. I love you guys. I love what you are doing. This is so cool. I love it. I love it. We are, we make such a special team. That's great. That's great. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much, people, for that. Thank you so, 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 so much. Thank you. That was uh, successfully done. And uh, should we start with the listen? Yes. Sure. yes. Okay, so you can, you can turn off your cameras right now. Thank you. You can close your cameras right now. Okay. Okay. Wait. Let me check on Yazan the beat. He's trying to tell us something. Okay, Yazan. Okay, Faris. It's okay. Yazan and Faris. It's okay. What's important is that you hear and you can see the activity and learn with us. Okay. So tell me seven thing readers when you can see the screen. And Lydia, Lydia, mute your mic, dear, so uh, we can continue because, yes, thank you. So tell me when you can see the close-up screen because today we are continuing with the exercises on uh, pages uh, 36 and 37. So let me just share it. Okay, can you see the screen now? 
ऐसे what the bells can you see the a close up screen yes teacher yes teacher yes teacher yes, 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 yes. okay okay that's good that's okay so the next readers we are going to continue on page 36 in your student books on page 36 in your student books okay one more time we are working on page 36 in your student books okay so yesterday yesterday we reached to exercise c we finished it and after that we have the exercise d for the exercise d it's your work it's the uh, it depends on uh, the student answers so for today in the lesson i'm not going to answer it maybe later when you're done with the exams I, I will let you do it but it's something that you can share between each other so i'm going to work with exercise E for today and for exercise E is asking from us look at the tickets and answer the questions in your notebook using the present continuous I don't want you to write that in your uh, in your notebook you have uh, you can just write it inside the uh, uh, box okay just use your book to answer okay so as the question told us you have to look at the tickets so what are these tickets for different events. What are these tickets? Tickets for? For different events, okay? So for this ticket okay. for an event and this ticket for another one, for another one and this ticket for another uh, exact one. Okay, so let's please just uh, check what we have inside the tickets. Then we will move to the questions, okay? For the first one here. Teacher, the microphone system kicked me out of the class. What? The Microsoft system kicked me out of the class. It's OK. You're here now? Yes, teacher. Okay. That's good. That's good. No problem. OK, so first we will take a look at each ticket by itself to understand what it is talking about. OK, please look at this one with me. On the side, it's written here music tickets so it's related to what music tickets so it's well, related to what i want to hear from all of you music uh, singing speak. roles singers yes yes all of the, all of the things that might be related to the music world okay let's go inside okay deep with this ticket um an evening with pearl jam an evening with pearl jam so the ticket is an invitation to be inside the event or inside the evening with with whom with pearl jam pearl jam since it's a music ticket is what maybe a team maybe a group maybe a band maybe a name of the band maybe a name of a singer okay so let's see after that they are telling you here that uh, uh, details and the notification about the tickets or this music event. It will be at the U.S. Bank Arena, uh, 100 Broadway Street. Uh, what is the street? Cincinnati? Yes, or oh, Cincinnati. Yes, Cincinnati. This is the country. Sorry, this is the place. In Cincinnati, O-H. Okay, so this is what? This is the area or the place that the band will be at in that evening. Let's continue. What time, what place? On Wednesday, October the 1st, 2015. This was so, 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 so old, but let's talk about it. It's okay. At 7.30 p.m. So the evening is with Pearl Jam, the band name or the singer name, since it's a music ticket. The place, U.S. Bank Arena, 100 Broadway Street at Cincinnati OH on Wednesday, October 1st, 2017, and the time is 7.30 p.m. Okay, let's see what we have here. Here is the seat details, okay? Can you see it? Seat number eight in row M. So when the person like you or me go to that, uh, let's say evening or to that uh, a music festival or something or music show, we will sit just like uh, deal with it uh, individually. When you go there, you have the row M and the seat is number eight. Okay, 
This is the date again. And here we have ticket number one. You see here T001. This is ticket number one, the number of the ticket. How many it costs? Uh, $39. $39. $39. For each. $39. Yes, so $39 for each ticket. Okay, so now we know all the details of this ticket, and I want you to, 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 to know, student graders, that this ticket has another name, okay? Can you see the details you have here without the uh, details of the seat? Okay, yes, teacher. Here, here in the middle. This uh, part of this ticket has a name which we call it poster or advertisement. Poster or advertisement or the ad for, uh, for using a shortened word. So we call this poster or advertisement. When you have something, you, you go and make a poster for it, right? Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes. Okay, do you know what's the meaning of a poster or advertisement? Manshur. Yes, yes. Okay, poster is Manshur. Okay, what's advertisement? Alan, yes. The girl who said the other word is the invitation. Okay, so we have advertisement or what or a poster and sometimes we add the details and some, sometimes we do not it depends on what you are making okay so i just want you to know the other names of this ticket but it's because of because it is a ticket we have to put the seat uh, and every detail that is related to the person who has this first ticket okay so let's go to the questions but uh, okay we didn't talk about these OK, so let's talk about this, then we move to the question. Let's just finish here. OK, the second one or the second ticket, let's say, it's talking about different event. OK, different event. Let's see here. Please look at the color. Sometimes the color of the poster, the advertisement, the invitation, etc., etc. It just it just gets your eyes. OK, so here for me, I love the color blue. So direct when I come to this page, I have to look at this one. OK, so the design uh, or, uh, uh, also matters for us. OK, so the graders, it's not just what's written inside the poster or the ticket. The design of that ticket is also important. OK, so let's go back here. We have the New York Jets verse. OK, verse. They are in a competition with Miami Dolphins. OK, so New York Jets with Miami Dolphins. So this is the name of a team. The team Jets represents New York City and the team Dolphins represents Miami Club, okay? So the event is happening where? So this is a match, 7th graders, okay? A match, like when you go and play with your friends inside a match. So this is a match between the Jets and the Dolphins. It will get place and time on October the 10th or the 10th of October in Wembley Stadium. So the name of the stadium is what? The name of the stad, what is it? Wembley. Wembley, Wembley Stadium. Okay, so, Wembley. so here are the ticket details. The gates open at 12.30 p.m. Kick off, the event will start or the match will start at 14.30. What's 14? One or two? Two. two. Two, yes. So the kickoff or the match will start at two and a half. The mm -hmm. enter via E. So the enter area or the enter the entrance uh, uh, door is called E. Block number uh, 300, row 10. And the block or the seat, let's say, will be 58. Okay, here is the smart, let's say the smart code. Do you know what the smart code is? The smart code. Yes, so this is the place. Can you see this with the lines here, the black lines? 
this this place or this uh, black code has a picture under it, a picture with a certain shape or a picture with a certain numbers. So when you go there, they don't have to touch you. They don't have just to put your numbers. You can just scan this uh, 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 rectangle. OK, you can scan or circle. I don't know. You can just scan it on a machine and they will know and make sure that it is you. OK, so even if you make this ticket online or you bought it from uh, a place, so they will just put it under your name with a code with numbers or a shape. So when you go there, they don't have to ask you for the code or the shape. They just will scan this uh, black area with lines and they will find uh, out or make sure it's you. Clear? Clear. Clear. OK, OK, that's good. Here in the last ticket, it's the United Flight uh, uh, um, <clears throat> excuse me, um, U354 for the words here or for the letters here. I think this is uh, a flight ticket. OK, so this is a flight ticket. When you want to travel and you have the ticket to in order to go to the uh, airplane that you are traveling with. Keep so up. this is a That's flight ticket. Excuse me. No, I'm talking about uh, that's in the airport. Yes, yes. This thing that you have to use before you just go around the world. So here, let's uh, let's read just the uh, um, details uh, uh, out of it. OK, so United Flight. This is what? This is the name of what? The name of? United Flight. The name of? What do you think? The airport? Yes, the airport. Yes, 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 the flying company. Yes. Yes, the company of this, uh, uh, let's say, flights here. Anna Patterson. Who's Anna Patterson? Uh, uh, the name who wants to travel. The name of the person the who wants to the person job. Yes, the name of the person who is the traveling here. Yes, the departure gate. What's the meaning of departure? The one you're leaving from? Yes, the gate you are leaving from. So here, the departure gate for Anna will be E12, E12. And I just want to tell you, seventh graders, that here, do you see the letters here? E, U, each one in the flight system or in the flying, let's say, world has a name, okay? So actually, when you go and say E, we don't say it E, we say it with another thing, okay? But it's the, uh, let's say it's the flight secrets, okay? So, or it's the airport secret. So each one or each letter has a name. We don't say it E12, okay? We say it another name, but between each other as, let's say, um, colleagues or colleagues inside the airports, they just deal with the names of the letters, okay? So letters in the airport have names. Okay, let's continue. Boards at, what's the meaning of boards? Uh, to go to the uh, uh, um, to go to the place the teacher the place is called wait for people who traveled before okay there is a boarding time a boarding time when we start boarding when we when you start to get at the what when you start at the plane inside the plane yes so boarding time will be 2 10 at 2 10 when pm at November 9th, and here is the business class. You have, you know that in the airplane there is the business class, the economy, and the first class. So Anna is traveling with the business class. Here is the code for the ticket, and here is the, let's say the ticket details or the seat details. The United flight with the number of it, seat number 19A, and the per the uh, per the person name again. And here is the departure time. For the uh, for this flight that will be uh, or the departure time will be at 2:50 p.m. Okay, let's move now to the questions to answer uh, about these uh, different tickets. Okay, for people who would love to answer, just raise your hands. Raise your hands. Can you raise your hands, seventh graders? I can't see hands up. Yes, 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 y
Teacher, I raise yes, my hand. Yes, teacher. I raise my hand. I'm raising my hand. I'm raising my hand. I don't know why I can't see it. Wait. wait. It's I raise my hand. From the okay, okay. Do you have to raise your hand? Just a second. Okay. Let me start with um, Aude. Yes, teacher. Which question? Yes, Aude. Start with the first one. Where uh, is the band playing? Okay, they're asking you about the band, so you are in which ticket? Uh, first one. The first one, okay. So where is the band playing? Tell us the place. U.S. Band yes. Arena. Band. Also, you have here the full title. Let's check your answer. So the yeah. band is playing at the U.S. Bank Arena. Excellent, Ode. Okay, Farah Al Farah. Yes, teacher. Question two. When is the band playing? Uh, on Wednesday, the first of October, two thousand and fifteen, at seven p.m. Seven thirty p.m. Yes, excellent, dear. So the band is playing on the 1st of October at 7.30 p.m. Yes, let me see who we have here who would like to answer. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, Elias? Yes, teacher. Yes, question three. When is the match starting? Okay, they are asking you about the match. So this is ticket. Uh... The match, the competition. This is ticket two, okay? Yes, teacher, I know. Okay, answer me. Starting in. Uh, uh, They're asking you about 12, the starting 30. time. 12.30. No, wait. Uh, Elias, they are asking us about the starting time, the kickoff time. Oh, the kickoff time. Uh, 2.30. Yes. 2.30, which is, look at this one, the match is starting at half past two. Yes, thank you, dear. Excellent answer. Okay, Angelina? Yes, teacher. Uh, question four. Where are the teams playing? Still asking us about ticket two, the match with the teams. Where are the teams playing? In New York. Check the ticket. I want the name of the place. The match is between the Jets and the Dolphins at October the 10th. In which place? Wembley Stadium. Yes, excellent. At the Wembley Stadium. They are playing at Wembley Stadium. Yes. Um, who is raising their hands? I don't know. Uh, Omar or Joseph or Natalie? Who's trying to answer? Teacher Natalie. Yes, Natalie. Uh, answer question five. Is the passenger flying business class or an uh, okay. uh, economy class? Okay, so Natalie, the question is about ticket three, the flight ticket. Okay, so it's the business. question is, the passenger is flying with which class, business or economy? Business class. Business class, excellent, yes. So the passenger is flying with business class, okay. Let's go to, let me check who we have here also. Let me see the hands. Yes, yes, Gamo. Yes, yes, yes. Please answer the last question, number six. Uh, where is the passenger uh, sitting? Uh, Mr. 19A. 
19A. So the passenger is sitting in seat 19A. Okay, so the passenger is sitting in seat 19A. Okay, excellent, dear. Yes, so this is or these are the answers for exercise E. Please, all of you seventh graders, write them down. Okay, because I'm not going to send the answers for this one. So please just write them down. Write them down inside your books because I'm not going to send the answers for exercise E because there's no place on the book for me to send. So please write them down. Okay, okay. I'm just waiting for your friends to finish. Are you done? Not yes. yet. Yes, teacher. Not teacher. Not teacher. Okay, okay I'm waiting. Just write faster. I'm gonna see some. Okay. So, seventh graders, let's move to page 37 so we can continue with the grammars. Okay. F exercise, read the sentences, then circle all the prepositions. We have to circle the prepositions, okay? So, we have 10 sentences with different prepositions and we have to circle them all. Okay, let's see who we have to choose in order to answer me. Sahem, Sahem Kakish. Yes, teacher. Yes, Sahem, please answer from one to five. From sentence one to five. Circle for us that preposition. Start with one. The plane is leaving at midnight tomorrow. At. At. Excellent. Two. They are having tests at school next week. At. At. We are, yes. Three. We are playing basketball on Monday evening. On. Yes. Four. My brother was writing on on his desk. On. Yes. On. The cat jumped. Onto my bed. Onto. Yes, excellent, Sahem. Yes, dear. Thank you. Reem? Yes, teacher. Yes, Reem. Answer starting with six, ending with ten. Okay. Um, dolphins, li dolphins live in the sea. N. Yes, N. Seven? Um, Sue is, li is having a party. In June, and yes, eight. The actor work, walked into the cafe for a drink. Into and two, yes, nine. What is what is inside the box? Inside. Excellent. Yes, ten. Um, the tourists are are le uh, traveling to Greek next week. Um, to uh, two. Two, yes, excellent, dear. Thank you, thank you, Reem. Adorable answers. Okay, now moving to exercise G. Exercise G is asking from us to look back at the sentences in F and then decide if each one refers to time, place, or direction. So the letter T resembles time, P resembles place, and the D resembles direction. Okay, so. First, or before we do that, we have to be careful. Be careful of what? Read for us, Joseph. Joseph? Joseph, can you hear me, dear? Yes, teacher. Yes, Joseph. Read for us the be careful box. Here, this one. Be careful. 
when we describe movement going from one place to another, we use the pre preposition, uh, preposition like to, into, onto, uh, forwards, and for, from. When we describe a position where something is, we use pre preposition like in, on, and at. Thank you, dear. Excellent reading. Okay, so be careful, books. We have to be careful of what seventh graders. That when we describe movement, we are talking about movement. The sentence uh, meanings or the sentence means something that moves, okay? We are talking about going from one place to another, okay? So the sentence will show us the going from one place or the movement from one place to another. Also, we use prepositions for these sentences like to, into, onto, towards, and from. So these uh, prepositions in order to describe or to talk about movement, movement from where? From one place to another. But when we describe position, when we are talking about a certain place of something or someone or a, or a place in general about something or someone, okay, where something is, we have to use the preposition in, on, and at, okay? So this is the difference. And please highlight this be careful box with V, I, P, okay? Highlight it with VIP. What I mean here is very important point, okay? Very important point, VIP, okay? Please write above this box, VIP. This is very important to you to go back when you study. So you can just, uh, uh, let's say, focus on the uh, difference between the movement preposition and the position preposition. Deal? Deal, Miss Ayesa, hi. This is page 37, Maria. 37. I can when had the October? Then I saw a lad. G, here, you can see it on the screen. Exercise G. Above this box, write very important or VIP, very important point. I can't just get on sir. Okay, yes. Lydia? Yes, teacher. Yes, read the answer from one to five. The plane is leaving at midnight tomorrow. Time. Time. Yes, two. They are having tests at school next week. Place. Place. Yes, three. We are playing ba uh, basketball on Monday evening. Um, play. Uh, uh, time. Time, yes, four. My brother, my, my brother was desk plate. I didn't hear that, Lydia. Miss Van Octobala. Guys, this is page 37 in your student books. We are solving exercise G. Yes, continue, Lydia. Please yes, repeat for my brother was on his desk at the place. Place. Are you are you sure? My brother was writing on his desk. Okay, let's check. Excellent. Place. Five. Yes, Lydia. Can you? Yes, teacher. Five. Can, can you repeat what did what did you for me? I didn't say something My important. Five. Five. Do five. There is no question. The Just cat, do five. The cat jumped into my bed. Direction. Direction. Yes. Excellent. Okay. Um, let me see who we have here. Wait. Rosalinda? Yes, miss. 
Yes, Rosalinda. Please answer from six to ten. Fast. <laughs> Dolphin live in the in the in the in the sea. Place? Place, yes. Seven. Uh, uh, so so have a party in uh, in June, yes, the answer. Time. Time, excellent. Eight. Uh, the actor walk uh, into the cafe for um, a drink. Drink. Yes. Direction. Direction. Yes. Nine. Uh, what is uh, inside the box? What is inside the box? Yes. Play. 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 Excellent. Ten. The tourists are traveling to. Did the you, east. I can't hear anything. Why? The to, the tourists are are travel, uh, traveling um, uh, to Greece. Um, Next week. Yes. Uh, Next week. Tom, what do you think? Tom? Time. It's direction because they are traveling to Greece. Okay. Yes. Excellent, Rosalinda. Yes, excellent answers, dear. Thank you. So, uh, seventh so graders, you asked me about where to put the answers. Did you, do you see? Um, an exercise F, okay? You have a place <laughs> to start the <laughs> Wait, guys, wait, listen. Listen to what I'm saying. In exercise F, you have a place, you have a space beside the numbers, okay? From 1 to 10. Just write the letters beside the numbers. If you don't have a place, create one, okay? So write the letters beside the numbers of exercise F. Got it? Got it, teacher. And I finished. Got it. Okay. Just a second, seventh graders. Miss? Yes. 